Next week, I'm taking a special trip. And next week is also the feast of St. Francis of Assisi. You know, one of the most popular saints of all Catholic saints, even non-Catholics, even atheists admire St. Francis of Assisi because he was so connected with the idea of peace. We're gonna have a blessing of the animals uh, on his feast day as well, because he had that special affection for all living life. But here's a story that most people don't know about St. Francis. During the Crusades, that time when armies from Europe were clashing with armies from Islam in the Middle East, Francis went to the Middle East. That was a really difficult time. He went to this area that's still troubled today. And he went to actually meet the Muslim king, the Muslim sultan, Muslim Malik al-Kamal. And he walked up to, them, to the Muslim and he said, I am here for the salvation of your soul. But the sultan was so impressed by his courage that he invited him to stay for a week of conversation. And at the end of that week, he was so impressed with Francis that he gave to Francis and the Franciscan order all of the Catholic churches and sites that are in the Holy Land. And the Franciscans operate those churches to this day, including the Church of the Holy Sepulchre, which is the church in Jerusalem built over the Calvary and Resurrection site. About 10 years ago, I joined a Vatican organization called the Order of the Holy Sepulchre, which is an international organization that raises funds for all of these churches in the Diocese of the Holy Land. Actually, that order raises 95% of the budget of this order. And they have their annual meeting for the Southwest U.S. chapter in Tucson, and I'm going to be attending uh, that association. You know, I, I take a group of people to the Middle East every year on an archaeological pilgrimage, so I'm fascinated by what's happening there and very interested in what's going on with the Catholic Church. And so it's a good fit for me to join this organization, to take care of our Catholic brothers and sisters in the Middle East. So that convention is this uh, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday in Tucson. I'm looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to it. And of course, I will be, St. Bruno's will be in my prayers as well.